County will get its first LGBTQIA plus commission report. Committee members have been working since June of last year, gathering feedback from the community about protecting their equal rights. KHU 11's Amanda Henderson live outside Commissioner's Court with a preview of what's in the report. Amanda? Yes, well, people who have worked closely with the LGBTQIA plus commission here in Harris County say this is the point of being able to turn words that they've been hearing into actions for this year and beyond. And they say it's critical, especially in light of the new state legislative session starting very soon. Harris County commissioners will soon get their first chance to learn about how a new commission is turning words into actions for Harris County. The past year has been one of foundational work, setting the commission up. Um, our office at Harris County Precinct 4 has supported a lot of that work. Last June, Harris County launched the LGBTQIA plus commission led by Precinct 4 County Commissioner Leslie Briones and her office. Blake Ellis says the goal is to work with the community to promote and protect LGBTQIA plus voices and equality. For three months, they gathered feedback through listening sessions on how to do just that. In a presentation provided to us, five policy recommendations include enhancing local data collection, making the commission the LGBTQIA plus liaison for the Harris County Sheriff's Office, introducing training for Harris County law enforcement agencies, having an LGBTQIA plus pipeline for county boards, and investing in LGBTQIA plus resources in the county. Mental health was something that came up over and over. In last year's state legislative session, a number of laws were passed directly impacting the LGBTQIA plus community, including a limit on what college sports teams transgender athletes can join. Jonathan Sines with Texas Values gives an outlook on what next year's legislative session might look like. So I think you're going to see a lot more questions asked about government using money for activist type of activities. We can't always control those decisions, but we can make sure that Harris County is a beacon of equality and justice for those communities. Tomorrow, the county commissioners are also going to hear how the LGBTQIA plus commission looks to put these actions in place for the following year as well. Live in downtown Houston, I'm Amanda Henderson, KHOU 11 News.